optional go outside. <laughs> Touch some grass, you guys. Hi, this is Cass from Aussie Cass Plays, and I decided I was watching. It was a Satchel Sims video, one from a little while ago, where he was suggesting different challenges, like ways to spice up your Sims game. And he suggested using Newcrest and doing a bunch of scenarios where each scenario is a different household, and then filling out Newcrest and a new map. I've never done a scenario in The Sims 4. These are like the beginning ones. I was just scrolling through them, trying to figure out which one I want to do because I don't really want to do. More more than one video on a scenario but there's a few here some are super easy uh complete all the goals i mean i don't know what that means but i thought we could start with one of these beginning ones this one sounds really interesting. Nova Curious was one of the best programmers in college and nothing will stop her from shining at a new job. Well, someone might. Lewis, top programmer in her class who overshadowed her during their uni years. Now she wants to start a professional life. There's no way she'll bump into him again, right? I don't know if it's going to put us in a new save. Uh, if this is putting us in medieval, that's not really an option. It is! A few moments later. All right, I've set up a new save. Let's go meet Town Meadows. So she needs to join the Tech Guru career and place a laptop. Did she start with a laptop? She did, and a telescope. All right, you guys, we have a house. I just downloaded a new Crest lot worth less than 20 grand, but then I actually went through because she started with a bit of extra money. I upgraded the appliances and a better bed. So I have customized it a little just because she had the cash for it, basically. But I wanted to keep a little bit of money in reserve because if she's starting at the base of the career, she may need the money. But this is the sim that The Sims has given me, although I did add some skin details. She is a computer whiz. She likes cooking, programming, electronica, green hip hop music, rocket science, white, gray, handiness, video gaming and black. So a bunch of colors and a few interests. She's a geek, a genius and ambitious. That is a Horrific pair of leggings. What have they done to you, Nova? It's terrible. All right, I've placed her laptop and she's going to find that tech guru career job. She needs to achieve programming level four. Oh, it started her at level four. That must be part of the scenario. That's really interesting. I take back what I said. They have actually made a sensibly skilled sim. Logic, fitness, video gaming, charisma, cooking. So she's not going to hopefully burn the kitchen down. Programming and mischief. Answer a mysterious call. What? Let's make a plugin because I think you can get money for that. Oh. Here we go. What up, Tuna Head? I heard you got a job at Rainy Days Entertainment, the same startup where I work. Ready to be overshadowed by me again? It'll be just like in college. Don't worry, when they fire you, I'll write you a recommendation letter for a senior loser position. Lol. Honestly, I want to shut this guy down. He's being a A-grade jerk, but I'm imagining this is sarcastic. Don't worry, we'll get to hang out all day at the office. See you there, Tuna Head. Tuna Head? What? I don't care about your family. Looks like Nova has not been getting along with a certain family-motivated sim. Family-motivated sims tend to put family first and often enjoy spending time with children. Some sims just don't understand it. Do I? Yeah, she dislikes this guy. It wants us to control our anger, so why don't we go and do that real quick? This is intended as a tutorial on how to play The Sims. You could do it, Queen. Don't let that jerk get you down. Become focused. How else do you become focused other than a chess table? Because you can't have a focused shower. All right, we have a cute little chess table out here. Well, it's ugly. It's the cheapest chess table in the game. Her spline reticulation plugin is second to none. 13 simoleons, you guys. Oh, hello. Let's do a respectful introduction. Does she feel like being proper? Nova feels being proper is very important to her and seems to be spending more time on herself. I'm going to say no because that will hinder my ability to call what's his face a jerk. But let's play some chess with Yasmin. Oh, do they like me too? Wait, we've got a crush. I think she's married. Sorry. All right, Yasmin, help yourself to the fridge. There's nothing in there, but you know, we became focused, which is awesome. All right, she is level four. That's awesome. Optional, lock your laptop. Look, I am going to do that. Optional, go outside. 
touches of grass, you guys. Where shall we go? There's a kid over there. We're not going to talk to them. Let's look for a frog. She gives me frog owner energy. Oh, we got a striped leaf frog. Did we touch grass? No. We have to specifically click go here. Unwind with your hobby. Go fishing. I know that's not the hobby they mean. They mean the telescope. They've made that very clear. Hey, fella. The only annoying thing is it started us on a Sunday and she doesn't actually work till Tuesday. Maybe we could get a fish tank or a, a fish bowl and we could have this little chill. I don't know. Hey, little guy. Look at you. Got a little castle fort there. And we're going to put the frog over here. I think she should be able to name all of her pets. Come over here. Let's do some stargazing because that is your hobby. I got this place from the gallery. There's no door on this side. So she has to go all the way around and it's really bothering me. I did it, you guys. I added a back door. All right. It's not giving me any specific instructions. So after this, I might tell her to go jogging. Oh, we're going jogging with the plate. Really? You couldn't have finished the food first? Meredith Roswell is asking me to go to Batu. Never. But also Meredith, are you confused? Have you forgotten which alien invasion you're dealing with? Yasmin's calling. You should want to go let, get to know Michael Bell, who Dr. Gluon calls the Hobbit. Do you want to get to go know the Hobbit as a friend? Go for it. Have a sim do nothing social for 24 sim hours. I mean, Beth Sterling's calling. Hey, hey, champ. So get this. I have a cool business idea. This is going to be the big one, but I uh, need a few more simoleons. You want a thousand simoleons? You'll get it all back and then some, I swear. We do have the money. I have literally never followed this story through with Bess. I'm going to do it. Thanks, Nova. I can always count on you. Do we even know each other? We do. And <laughs> we don't get on. I realize this might be my fault. I'm not sure if the Sims team gave them bad compatibility to start with or whether me saying yes to disliking family-oriented Sims has created this. Hey, Nova. So listen, it's a long story, but my family's in a bit of a pickle right now and we need a place to stay for a bit. You have extra places to sleep, right? Isn't this like a family of three? Isn't it her and a wife and a kid? Am I misremembering which family this is? Look, I don't. I'm sorry, Yasmin, but I legitimately don't have space for even one sim. I'm thinking I might take her out to a bar for dinner, have her get some pub food, just because her social needs getting a bit low. All right, I've bought Nova to Club Calico, but I just went and downloaded the little Simsy Reno of it because it's really ugly. Ooh, bartender. Oh, it's not Lothario. I was like, who is this? Come on. No, get off the computer. I brought you here to get you off the computer. Come here. Oh, hey, Morty. Hi, Morty. I'll be interested to see how good a read of character she is. Let's have a look. Don thinks Nova is pretentious. Benice also thinks she's pretentious. He thinks she's pretentious too. It's because of the ambitious trait, I'm guessing, or genius. It could be either. Maybe this person won't think I'm pretentious. Let's do a friendly introduction to Lian. Hi, she thinks I'm pretentious too. Sweet. Let's say hello to this person. They actually get on. It's Agnes! Oh my god! Is this Agnes's hot weather wear? That is brilliant! Oh no, it's a swimwear. Stop ordering drinks, we're leaving! You've been really generous. I'm getting close to starting my company, but a thousand simoleons. You want more money? Does that mean my thousand simoleons was wasted? Oh sweet, we got some free earbuds. <laughs> She's got work very soon. Let's just have her brush teeth. Because I think everything else the Sim will do at work, like they'll eat and everything at work, but they won't do hygiene things. All right, good luck. All right, she's home. I forgot to tell her to work hard. So, of course, she didn't get promoted. I mean, she wouldn't have got promoted anyway. All right, she made a malware blocker plugin for 11 simoleons. Ooh, it's the lottery. I want to try and get her promoted today to like move to the next stage of whatever this is. Have a good day. All right, before you go super speed on me, I'm going to say work hard. Eleanor's calling. You want to go on a date with Caleb for tour? Sure, why not? I mean, maybe he's into grannies. I don't know. Uh, my business is still taking some time to get. She needs a thousand bucks to move things forward. Fine. I'll do it. We have a hundred simoleons left. Probably a terrible idea. Alrighty, promotion incoming, ladies and gentlemen. Whoop, whoop. Her next shift is Thursday and she got a hipster hugger. Is it a couch? It's a chair, I was right. Oh, and a coffee machine. And we got a clock too. I actually really hate the coffee machines in this game, but we'll keep it for now and I'll decide if she gets to keep it based on how annoying she is with it. All right, you need to get promoted again and complete your daily task. 
Lewis is calling. Hey Nova, guess what? I got promoted too. I used my bonus to buy furniture and made it rain. I got lots of flashy new items that will quickly get me into a good mood so I have even more time for career advancement. Smart, huh? You gotta spend money to make money. I gotta admit, I'm surprised you were promoted as well. Must have been luck. When I'm your manager, I'll make sure mistakes like that don't happen again. I already did buy stuff. Mod, incredible sports. And while she's doing that, I'm going to have a quick look at this bed. Uh, okay, so that's only a four. We'll get rid of that. What can I afford that's a six? Actually, this one probably goes better with the bedroom. Let's get that. We have 20 simoleons left. Awesome. Go to work feeling confident. We can probably manage that. Make a plug-in or virus. She's currently doing a side job. Buy a shower with a hygiene rating of seven. Well, we won't be able to afford to do that until after she's been to work, unless she finishes this side job and it's worth a decent amount of money. Hello there. I just wanted to welcome you to the community and that's a lovely neck you have there. Go away, Vlad. If I lock my doors, for everyone but me. Can Vlad still break in? <gasps> no, go away, Vlad. Go away, Vlad. I hope the lightning gets you. I mean, I could set this to no trespassing and actually disable vampires, but I'm not gonna do that. Justin Delgado won. Nova owns a thousand aspiration points. They gave me a thousand, didn't they? Cause I was watching her aspiration points cause I wanted to get her gym rat or observant. Cause they're the two that I like to have all my sims own cause I'm lazy. And she was just under 500 last time I looked. Bess is asking for money again. I've got 20 simoleons. I don't know what you want from me. I mean, I do money. I usually go observant and gym rat as my first two. And the other one I usually like to get is waterproof because that stops your sim getting sick as often. Eleanor had a really nice date with Caleb, if you guys are wondering. I suspect she doesn't remember a lot of it. They were making out and he was kissing her neck and then she doesn't remember anything else. I'm sure it's fine. Also, Nova's starting to get dazed, which is a problem. I can't have her continue doing mental things and all of her hobby things are mental. All right, I brought her to the Salty Paws Saloon this time. Wait, I ordered food. Where are you going? Hey, Morty. Why does Mortimer keep hanging out at the bar? Those glasses. What are you doing? Oh, autograph. Hi, can I have your autograph? Look, there's nothing weirder than asking someone for an autograph or a selfie or something in the bathroom. I was actually listening to a podcast the other day where it was a, a YouTuber who's like a streamer and he was talking about how he was at a con like pax con or something and he was in the men's bathroom uh using the urinal and a child came up to him with camera and asked for a selfie and he was horrified and i'm not surprised oh my god lilith are you okay bearberry black he's actually quite cute let's do a friendly friendly introduction to the paparazzi man kleptomaniac child of the islands and a glutton wait he's enamored of me we just met my guy I don't care if you have a crush on me. Uh, I didn't get much social out of that, but I did get a sweet, sweet autograph, which a praise <laughs> right now. Otherwise, how else am I going to afford next time Bess calls to ask for money? 400. My pushes is over a thousand, but I probably should buy that shower. Bess is calling again. I can't afford it right now, Bess. You called before I had a chance to sell the Judith Ford thing. There we go. Now you can call me back and I can afford it next time you call. I'm being scammed. It's fine. I really should check out the showers. Maybe I will do that. Maybe Bess can wait a little bit longer. The cheapest one is the fitness stuff pack one. Sorry, Bess, still don't have any money. Don't know what to tell you. Optional purchase of food. <laughs> oh, those are like a thousand simoleons. Do you think I have that kind of money? As much as I want her to get promoted, I'm a little bit worried if I send her to work with the mental fog burnout trait that she's actually going to, she's going to hit full on burnout time so i might have her take the day off by the way i called the fish spline because she was working on reticulated splines yeah that's actually starting to make that go away that's really good i should probably have actually had her do this last night and gotten rid of the moodlet Bess, i don't have the money oh i paid got paid for being off okay so next time best calls i can give her the money also it's telling me now to buy a reward trait but it's specific ones that it wants her to get spice festival sure free food all right, we're trying the uh, spicy food challenge. Oh, hey, it's another celebrity. You want to get Dolly, get to know Dolly Robles better as a friend? Sure. Thank you for the autograph. Hey, Judith's here. Hey, Judith, can I have an autograph? Look, it would actually be cool to have some to keep as well. Judith's not feeling particularly receptive today. Wait, I've got three. Oh, whoops. Uh, anyway, it's fine. That means I have one to keep and one to sell. 
All right, for this I need to buy the festival t-shirt. I told her buy and wear. Nice. Freezer bunny snow globe. Sold. Oh my god, Morty's here as well. I'm starting to think he's sp he's he a secret agent. Is he following me? Is he working for the enemy? Is he working for Lewis? Morty just came up and bought himself the same t-shirt. Faye Harris is over here puking on the ground. Stop it, Faye! Go away! Faye! Oh my god, poor Jeb. I can't handle the vomiting, so I'm going to take her home. All right, Nova's unlocked the techie lifestyle. So if you're wondering what the techie lifestyle is, she gets benefits when interacting with technology. She prefers to use technology over non-electronic objects. She gains skill in programming and rocket science faster. She can overclock the computers and enthuse about processing power. Improve success when repairing and upgrading electronics, which is good because the laptop just broke. Increased work performance. Fantastic. And tense on a lot without power or without technology for too long. I saw what you did last week. I saw everything. You're in big trouble, Missy. I got pranked by Brittany Cho. Are you kidding me? Bess Sterling. Yeah, sure. Take the thousand. Yasmin keeps distracting me. Now we're going to the flea market. Hey, Yasmin, your wife is here and she's pregnant. I have to buy something. There's not really anything here that I want. Let's haggle with you. Are you overspending money on alcohol again? All right, I'm going to buy this knife block. We got a knife block. We're going to head home. Morty's here again. He is genuinely spying on me. Clement has asked you on a date. Wait, Eleanor dated Caleb and now she's dating Santa? Who is this lady? Bess is still asking for money. How many times am I supposed to do this before I get something out of it? I'm going to give her the money. I can afford it, although we are going to need to get paid in order to pay the bills. I've just had her come and say hi to Jeffrey Langrab just because her social need was super low and I wanted to be in a good mood for work. Bills have got up to 834. All right, promoted to development captain. She'll now make an additional blah, 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 blah. She got an award for excellence. Wait for call about layoff rumors. Get distracted with a hobby. Does quit the rat race mean I got fired? Surely I will have more programming skill than Lewis. She's like programming level nine now. Yes, Nova, the rumors are true. I got fired from Rainy Days Entertainment. It seems I have an attitude problem. That's their way of saying I've basically been a jerk, specifically towards you, especially towards you. Can I come over and talk? I could really use a friend right now. Sure, come over, tune ahead, or I'll, I'll take a pizza as an apology. I hope pepperoni is still your favorite. No, he's not allowed to be nice. Also, why are we sick? Has the salad gone off? I mean, it's been in the fridge for a week. Humor and hijinks. Oh, I could get that voodoo doll. Although it doesn't want me to get the voodoo doll anymore. I'm going to say no because I'm waiting for my free pizza. Hi. So I love that you got fired for being a jerk. Clement is, she's in love. She said the same thing about Caleb. You're bored. Seriously. You came over here because you were feeling sad because you got fired for being a jerk to me. And now you're here being a jerk to me. Friendly or funny to improve or mean to be mean. The guy is a jerk. They're already not getting on. I'm not doing anything. That's just happening on its own. But she's not being mean. So there's nothing to indicate she would lean mean or friendly. Oh, she was just friendly on her own. They hate each other. I actually don't know which way she went. Wow, Nova, I'm at a loss for words. I lost my job. I just hope I haven't lost my childhood friend as well. I'm in no position to ask, but could I spend the night here while I figure out my next move? They were childhood friends. Why was he? So I mean, that explains the tuna head thing. But also, dude's a jerk. Decision. Invite Lewis to stay or kick Lewis out. Reconnect with Lewis, call a meal, flirt, instill him with false confidence or get distracted by a hobby. I don't really want to flirt with him. Also, he promised me pizza. Hi, Wolfgang. Let's invite you in. I guess I'm making food for a werewolf and a jerk. I'm so sad about the pizza. The whole reason I invited him here. It's fine. Let's make Italian meatballs. We'll make a family size. Nova doesn't get on with pretty much anybody I've noticed. I guess I could get to know him and stuff. Decide whether he's worth wasting time on. I don't think that she'd kick him out if he's homeless. I just don't know how friendly I'm feeling to this guy. End of phase. Go to sleep. Appreciate you letting me crash here for the night while I get myself together. I honestly expected you to laugh in my face. Thanks, Nova. I won't forget this. I mean, I don't want to flirt with him. I just don't think he deserves it. I get the whole enemies to lovers thing, and these two look like they'd make a cute couple, but also, I don't want to apologize to you. Love that he got himself fired, though. Hilarious. Also, I'm sleeping on the couch now. Get promoted or become friends with Lewis and become friends with Lewis. Do I want to team up with Lewis? 
Why am I sleeping on the couch? He should be sleeping on the couch. Go to bed. I didn't want her to go to sleep yet. I wasn't ready, but that's fine. Thanks for allowing me to crash at your place, Nova. I got you this space print as an apology for being a jerk. It reminded me of the night we spent at your dad's observatory. Not that I think about it often or anything. Place it near your computer and activate it. It will help boost your programming skill. And again, sorry for being a super competitive tuna head. Fine. I'll hang the picture. Oh, the pizza was in my household inventory. There it is. And we can em enable the emotional aura. And then I will put the pizza in the fridge. So I did get pizza. It's just he put it in storage. Lewis had a bit of a personal emergency and had to leave now. I mean, dude's unemployed and maybe homeless. So fair. Nova's just gotten home from work. I didn't, because it was on fast speed, I didn't have her work hard all day. Yasmin wants to come over and hang out. I'm going to say no, Yasmin, because I need to become friends with Lewis. As much as I don't really want to. I just don't like the bullying. He was bullying. I get that he was probably like acting like he used to act when they were kids. All right, Lewis, let's complain about our problems. Look, that's pretty funny to the guy who just got sacked, but we'll do it anyway. Uh, watch a movie with, watch uh, Moonlight Massacre with Lewis. Oh, oh, I see the problem. That's why he stayed on the porch. It's fine. I had locked the door, remember? So. <laughs> hey, Bess. Are you seriously? Now she's once one Zamolian. She already bankrupted me. Think how much more money I'd have if I hadn't have spent like 3,000 Zamolians on Bess. Oh my God. Can I call her out? If I call her out, just like, do I get some money? Here's a few thousand simoleons. Lady, that was not a good investment. It's fine. Do you like this couch? I got it for having a job. Describe a new idea. There's a back guitar solos. Should I apologize? I don't think she has anything to apologize for, but she, maybe she could be saying, look, I'm sorry you got fired. Ask what his problem is. I don't think these guys are going to be able to be friends. I said yes to that whole, do I dislike family oriented Sims thing. Let's just, I'm just going to say try to make friends and we'll let the game do it. No, still not getting on. It's a casual discussion. Now it's tedious. Wonderful. Now it's awkward. Even better. Now it's casual again. And now she's bored. You know, Lewis, I think you should probably leave before we make this any worse. And then I'm going to have her go to bed. <laughs> Hey, we made a mobile app and we're now a notable newcomer. Tick tack. It's a hot new dancing app. Have a good day, Nova. All right. So she is halfway through good. Again, I didn't hit work hard immediately. I'm used to Sims that I've raised from infants where they get the responsible trait and then they work hard automatically. We need to do something to make friends with Lewis again. Yeah, sure, you can be neat. I hate the neat trait. I just remembered. I just remembered I hate the neat trait. Where's that guy that we need to make friends with because the game says so. We're being a good friend. We're checking up on him. He got fired. Let's ask about his career. Seems insensitive, but maybe he's found a job already. Hey, my guy. Found a job yet? He is unemployed. Let's encourage him to pursue his dream job. Uh, we don't know each other well enough. Well, that's fair. I mean, we're meant to be childhood friends, but we also don't get on. Sedentary tips. She got the sedentary lifestyle. It's unfortunate. Let's discuss his sad mood. He doesn't look sad, but okay. Become friends with Lewis. Difficulty level impossible. I mean, it's slowly going up but they don't get on tell a joke about martians it's going down again you guys this is proving to be impossible from offering someone career advice if you think career advice is always welcome better think again lifestyle denied from having a poor discussion about lifestyles dude ask what his problem is is there an option that isn't making friends with this guy? Can I just get promoted and not make friends with this guy? Is this optional? I really don't like you very much right now. Just feeling bitter over a few things that I'll get over eventually or not. I don't think this scenario can tell me what to do. Let's argue about career. Don't nap. Argue about career. This scenario is not the boss of me, you guys. I'm a celebrity. Get you out of here. Yeah, be sad. You're a jerk. Go home. I don't like you, you don't like me, it's fine, get out. I'm hoping this is optional and that we can just get promoted and move on with our lives. 
She is so close to getting promoted. She should get promoted tomorrow. On the condition, I can get rid of this moodlet. 24 hours of burnout and she's sedentary now. So when I try and make her do exercise to get rid of it, she's going to get very mad. So what we're going to do is go to the bathroom. We're going to take a brisk shower and then I'm going to send her for a jog and she's going to hate it. Actually, maybe I'll have her do the dance workout video thing. Maybe that won't bother her as much because she's not leaving the house. Can I sit please? Nova has been on her feet for far too long and she needs some time to relax and take it slow. I'm sorry, but we've got to get rid of this moodlet. Uh, can you do some power sculpting? Yes, queen. A crazy party at the chalet. Will that get rid of my dazed and tense moodlets? All right, we're at this dance party. Let's make some friends. It's so weird being in this neighborhood where it's the original. Obviously, this is where the palace is in Medieval Legacy. So I'm very used to this neighborhood, but not with this stuff on it. Yeah, Candy, let's go. Oh my God, Candy thinks she's pretentious too. Is it going down? It is going down. Awesome. All right, we're having a pleasant conversation, but Candy does not care. This is a very difficult sim to find someone compatible for. I think it's because I said I didn't like family-oriented sims. Hey, it's the mermaid. Hello, mermaid man. Wait, did we get on with the mermaid? Good compatibility. They like each other on first sight. Self-assured child of the islands and glutton. I always think of him as the evil mermaid because of his appearance, but that's that's really mean. Let's support his facial hair. Sorry, if we were to get together as a couple, you'd have to live in Newcrest. That's the rule I established for myself. Share some sedentary tips with the mermaid. Hey Vlad. He's like, yes, I've come to dance to your party. Kiss hands. Why is she feeling flirty? A crush is nearby. Who is the crush? I have no idea who she had the crush on. Look, I have to go home because I have to get promoted tomorrow. So I'm going to go. I am going to have her do a flirt with the mermaid before we leave. I love that she's doing all this in a workout wear. All right, they've flirted. Achievement unlocked. Sorry, Leanne, I'm going to abandon you here. I have to go home. I have to work tomorrow. Unfortunately, she's got four hours left on this moodlet and she's about to go to work. I don't know what else I can do about that because I do want her to go to work and try and get promoted. I will have her work hard at least until we get the tick. Yeah, okay, there we go. Oh no, it's going down, it's going down, it's going down. Work hard again. I assume it's going down because her mood was negative. Yes. Esports gamer or startup entrepreneur. She is a startup genius. Nice. We are the next big thing. Do I have to? Oh no, she's burned out. I knew that was a pretty decent chance. Maybe in the interest of actually ever being able to finish this thing, I'm going to change her dislike of family oriented sims. I'm not going to say she likes them. I'm just going to make it neutral and we'll see how they get on. So I'm just going to take that off because I'm never going to finish this. I've been recording for a couple hours now. Okay, so we are neutral to him now. Do you want to go out on a date? I do, you Kupanipo. I'm going to say no just because I want to finish the scenario. But yes, I'd rather go out on a date with you. I mean, there's nothing that says we have to get romantic with this guy and I'm not planning on it. You're in my house. Throw love day confetti. Is that romantic? That's not going to be romantic, right? Hey, dude. He's angry. Awesome. Let's do a smooth apology. Support his facial hair. I'm just going to click try to make friends. Maybe he'll get over it. He's not getting over it, you guys. Uh, a concert at an abandoned warehouse. Of all the sims to drag my sim into like parties and stuff, I didn't think it would be Yasmin Tinker. I'm gonna say no because again, I'd rather be doing that, but we have to do this. Can we please just make friends? Come on, mod, you can do this. Hey, Lilith, I'm not letting you in. Go away. He's talking about vampires. There's a vampire outside. I mean, it checks out. What if he died? What if he died of mortification? What would happen to the scenario? Do I like spirited sims? Let's say yes. Okay, I've had the best idea. We understand each other and we work well as a team, right? I would not agree with that. What if we created our own game or app together and became indie developers? No one could fire us ever again. Come on, Nova, let's stick it to the man. I'll share with you the secret beverage I use to boost performance. If you start coding right after you drink this, you'll level pro your programming skill. Yes, cash is trash. Am I going to get fired? Optional quit your job. Oh, it's optional. 
Here's the deal. It's the fastest way to learn skills. Make sure you go to the toilet before you drink it. The snaggle fluster can be very diuretic. I sometimes program while at the toilet to be more efficient. Well, I'm not using it right now. I'm very tired. Snaggle fluster, a mythical recipe bought off a mysterious hermit. That is really funny. <laughs> Love day was awful. Look, yep, that's fine. I had to pass up on a date to hang out with my ex-friend, who I guess is my actual friend now. Are we actually friends now? Okay, fine. The problem we've got is she's burnt out. If I have her do programming now, she's gonna get brain block, which would be deeply unfortunate. So I think I need to like wait that out. You heard he became friends with Lewis. Yeah. What happens when this runs out? Is it gonna go to another phase or is it just gonna be gone? All right. I'll drink the drink. And then what do I have to do? Make an app or a video game. I had actually started her on making something already. So I'm hoping that'll count. Whoa, that goes down so fast. That's by being third trimester pregnant. <gasps> She's maxed the programming skill, you guys. Does that apply to any skill? Doesn't say. All right, stop. I'm not gonna use my laptop on the toilet. Aside from anything else, I don't think you can. I mean, she's doing quite well at the moment because I've stopped giving best sterling money. I feel robbed. I thought this was gonna be like a share market type thing. If you've continued to pay best sterling forever, let me know what happens. If I'd continued going for a certain amount of time, would I have had a huge payout at the end? Or was she just gonna leech money off me forever? Are we not snaggle? We're not snaggle toothed anymore. Let's drink another one. Yasmin wants to hang out. Look, I'm gonna say no, cause I've got to focus. Yeah. Jasmine. The Romance Festival. Scenario completed! Whoop whoop! The Curious family has received the following rewards for completing the Stuck in Their Shadow scenario. Uh, she landed her dream job, worked on a passion project, managed to rekindle her friendship with Lewis. Eh. How she managed to juggle everything and still get some sleep is a mystery that remains to be solved. She can proudly close the first chapter of her career as the ultimate overachiever. Will she be able to strike a good work-life balance now she'll have so much on her plate? And what will she spend all of that nice passive income on? It's up to you to decide. Well, I never finished finished the mod, did I? We're still under the effect of the Snagglepuss thing. Program. No, we never finished it. Why did it say we were finished? We still had like a third of the wheel to go. I don't really understand what happened there, but I'm not going to look a gift completion in the mouth, but I might have her have someone move in uh, under what conditions. Thank you. And then my plan was like, it'd be cute to have a couple living in the house is my only thought. And then when I do another scenario, we'll put them here. Or here and then we like build out the neighborhood with sims that we've played so it's like rotational but scenario based rotational but also not rotational because i'm probably never going to visit them again the only sim nova has had any compatibility with has been mermaid man other than technically now she has good compatibility with lewis i just i have reservations about that anyway i'm gonna end this one here this recording is really long and i'm gonna have to edit it down so sorry about that future cast if you have enjoyed please like and subscribe you know the drill don't forget to wash your your hands and I will catch you next time. Thanks for watching.